Select your door panels according to your instruction manual and lay them out with the small ribs to the outer edges. Door panels are supplied with a partial perforation on the small rib. Carefully bend this perforation until the section snaps off and discard them. Overlap the panels and join using a clip nut behind the sheet to secure the screw. Fit the top and bottom door frames, ensuring that the smaller lip is to the outside face of the panels. Secure the two panels at the middle pre-drilled holes. Fit the side frames into place over the top and bottom frames. Make sure the big hole sits over the small hole. Secure each corner. Slide the door boxing into place with the labels facing outwards. If your kit has double doors, slide the supplied door seal into place, making sure it sits between the frame and the boxing. Secure with six screws on each side through the large oval holes. Flip the door panels and fix the frames with six screws on each side of the door. Lay the door bracing in place on the back side of the door in a V pattern and mark the center point along the edge that will not be hinged. Pre-drill a hole through the door frame and secure the bracing to the frame at each end. Pre-drill holes through the bracing and the door panel at equidistant points. With the bracing in place, flip the door panel back to its front side and secure the bracing from the front. Repeat this process for the second door if needed. Align your hinges with the holes on the side door frame and secure into place. Fit the door plate to the door without the door seal and attach a pad bolt. Align your completed door assemblies with the front wall assembly and secure the hinges to the door jams through the pre-drilled holes. Mark the positions of the top and bottom pad bolts, drill holes and fix with screws. With your door in the closed position, align and fit the bottom pad bolt keeper to the inside of the door spacer. Finally align and fit the outside pad bolt keeper 